Help! Help! Melon, did you hear that? Somebody needs our help! Who is it? Don't worry. Melon is here to save you. Bro, it's a little kid getting attacked by wolves. Don't worry, we'll save you. Take him out. We're heroes, and we don't even take payment for this. Oh, yes, we do, Melon. Let's just start by taking them out. These puppies are angry. Help! I've got my second dog down. You got that, Sonny. Bro, I literally just took on the whole entire pride. But I did it. They're done for. You're safe, little kid. Thank you so much. Here's $10. No way. Sonny, we just made money. Let's go. You guys should open a bodyguard company for your services. You guys are really good at this. Melon, this kid's a genius. We should open a bodyguard company. You're right, Sonny. This way, we can make so much money. It's not about protecting people at all. It's about big business. <laughs> hey, did you hear that, Melon? It sounded like sunshine laughing. Hey, what's the big idea? Why are you laughing at us? You guys are too scrawny to be bodyguards. You think little twigs like you could defeat anything? Well, yeah. We just defeated a whole pack of wolves and saved a little kid in the streets. Those were just little puppies. You killed innocent puppies. Those weren't even wolves. Yeah, it might have been a little immoral, but it's all about money at the end of the day, and we're still gonna become bodyguards. Not with those tiny muscles. <laughs> Melon, they're right. We have to work out and get stronger. Follow me. Sonny, where are we going? To the gym. Time to get body -bit. Building. Yeah, we're gonna get swole. Melon, you got that $10 on you? Yeah, but do I really have to pay up for a gym membership? It's time to invest in our gains. Fine. Here's the $10. Now, can we get swolely? Yeah, welcome to the gym. Good luck training. Let's go, Melon. No pain, no gain. I'm in! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Start with the weights. Start with the weights, Melon. To the father, the son, and the swolely spirit. Yeah! Oh, I'm feeling it already. I'm feeling it already. Dismount. Punching bags. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, those were just weights. Hold on. Hold on. Bench press. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Yeah. I'm feeling jacked. Absolutely juiced to the gills. Yeah, Sonny. Check it out, bro. We've got muscles on our muscles. Bro, you're absolutely shredded. Check those abs out. Hoo, hoo. Ow. Sorry, Melon. I didn't know my own strength. It's fine, Sonny. You just trained my abs. Now punch me again. Let's go. One, two, three. And you probably barely felt that, bro. We are absolutely ready to create the best bodyguard business in Minecraft. Oh, no. Help me. Do you hear that, Melon? It sounds like someone in need of bodyguarding. What's going on here? Please, these guys are picking on me. I'll give you $100 if you beat them up. Swole Steve, swole Alex. Is this true? Ha ha ha. Of course it's true. It's true. Look at that scrawny nerd. Yeah, he is a little thin, but that's no excuse to bully someone. Now I'm going to bully you. Die. Put him in their place. Put him in their place. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. Here's $100. Oh, Sonny, we have $100. Do you know what we could do with this? We can invest it into our new bodyguard offices. That way people can contact us for our service whenever they need it. Let's go. Also, kid, you're in the right place. You definitely need to work out. Sonny, best $100 we've ever spent. Check out our new HQ. Bro, I can't believe this is only $100 a month to rent. This is awesome. We got a sunny seat and a melon chair. And now all we do is wait for our first client. Sonny, we have our very first customer. Let's go. Mr. Villager King, how can we be of help? There's pillagers attacking my kingdom. I need you to help defend it. I'll pay you $1,000 for this job. <gasps> Sonny, let's Let's go save this village. We're gonna need half the payment up front, though. No problem. Here's some cash. Melon, this is incredible. Let's go to the village. Melon, the villager king was right. There's a pillager raid on the way. Sonny, we need to defend the village. Be careful. These pillagers don't play around. They're really strong. But don't worry. We've got muscles and we're professional bodyguards. So let's split up, Melon. Look, the pillagers are here. Where are they, Sonny? Maybe don't split up. Maybe just stay with me then. The iron golem's cleaning them up. Yo! I'll kill the other pillagers, Sonny. You take... Oh, wait. Those are all the pillagers. There's gotta be more. Says Raider's remaining one. Oh, here he is. <laughs> 
pathetic. That was the weakest raid ever. Bro. Oh, it's charging up again, Melon. Yeah, bro, there's multiple waves. We've got at least four more of those to go, and it's only gonna get worse. There they are. They're swarming the Iron Golem. We have to help them. Look, the IG can do a lot, but he can't do it all. Oh, yeah. Vindicator, dead. Less cook. Well, I'm not really doing much for this raid. Yeah, Melon, I think we just gotta spawn camp them. Looks like the pillagers keep showing up right here on this Iron Golem. Maybe that's where they always spawn in on the IG. Yep, here they are, Sonny. Take them out. Oh, no, they've got a Ravenger. Not the Ravengers. They're too powerful, Melon. We need to use all of our muscles on them. Swoll! Swoll! Oh, I took him out, Sonny. Bro, you are way too hench. How'd you get so strong? I uh, hit the gym pretty hard. And we did it, Sonny. We conquered the raid. Let's go. Collect our payment. Yeah, that's true. That king owes us another $500 for this. And honestly, when I see the size of this village, I think we got scammed, Melon. We could have probably got double the money. Yeah, we'll know better next time. Thank you for saving the village. As agreed, here's your other money. Not a problem, villager king. If you have any issues in the future, let us know. We're gonna have to up our rate, though. I certainly hope there won't be problems anymore. Thank you. Sonny, we just made our first $1,000. That's incredible, bro. We should invest that in Dogecoin. No, that's stupid. We need to invest it in our company, Sonny. Oh, yeah, you're right. That makes a lot more sense. So maybe we put up some marketing materials. I've got these ominous banners from the raid. This should probably attract some new customers. They know we're capable of stopping even a pillager raid. Yo, you mad genius. And now we just sit back, relax, and wait. We didn't even have to spend our $1,000. Sonny? I think you attracted an evil villain. No, no, Melon, relax. That's just the Pillager King. If we were to help out the villagers and not the pillagers, that would just be wrong. I need help. Some iron golems are raiding my base. I know, um, you just took out a group of my men. We've been warring with those villagers forever. It's not as one-sided as you think. They attack us too. Whoa, Melon, the lore is crazy in Minecraft. Well, we'll do anything for a price, Mr. Pillager. Yeah, and the villagers paid us $10,000 to help them. Melon, just go with it. $10,000 and we'll help defend your base. Oh, that's cheap. Sure. What? That's cheap. Ugh, whatever. We said we'd do it for 10k, so we'll do it. Well, Melon, looks easy enough. I see the pillager tower and I don't see any incoming villagers. Seems pretty chill. Yeah, this ain't too bad. Uh, Melon? Where'd these guys come from? Villager raiders, take them down. Oh my gosh, they're so weak. I'm gonna kill them with my fists. Eat that and this and that and this. -a. I'm gonna kill them with a piece of bread. Take that! <laughs> yeah, bro. Eat my bucket. <laughs> Bro, you need some hydration? How about some H2O water? We really wiped those villagers out. Yep. Bro, turns out going to the gym makes you really powerful. Melon, we spoke too soon. They brought the iron golems! Defeat them at once! I'm taking them out, Sonny, but these guys hit hard. Yeah, and they're jacked, bro. They definitely went to the gym. Retreat! I'm going back, brother. Oh my goodness, this guy is wrecking me, Sonny. We went to the gym, but so did they. They're the original boss. Bodybuilders. These guys are huge. I'm almost dead. We lift the iron. They are the iron. That's true, bro. This is pretty ironic to be battling them. But I know their one weakness, Sonny. Grab some blocks. I thought you were going to say water. I'm going to make them all rusty. No, I'm grabbing some blocks. You just need three blocks. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, no, I messed up. I only had two blocks. How did I even do that? It's okay. I got these guys rusty in the water. They're just sinking to the bottom, bro. They're built like anvils. <laughs> Easy clap. Yeah, Melon, I was right. Just just push them to the bottom of the ocean. They can't get out. See? I got two of them stuck down there. Sonny, I'm at one heart right now. This is not good. Don't worry. I got your back. Stay away from these golems. And slice them, dice them, thrice them. I got them, Sonny. Boom. Nice strategy, bro. That was clean. Well, I'd say the pillagers have been totally protected, except I see the commander of the villager army still lurking. Let me go KO him real quick. Hey there. How about you eat? A knuckle sandwich! Well, he did eat one. Yep, he sure did. But his appetite was too big. He couldn't handle two of them. We protected your lands, Pillager King. Those villagers will leave you alone. And I think you guys should probably just make a truce and stop battling. Thank you so much. You guys are the best bodyguards I've ever seen. You've even restored peace to Minecraft. Your money's in the shulker box. Goodbye. Sonny, who cares about peace when you've got money? Ten thousand dollars! Bro, we are stinking rich. We gotta upgrade this place. 
Yeah, it's about time, Sonny. The next day, the headquarters is looking awesome, Melon. Yeah, bro, and we still got tons of money. Bro, we're stinking rich. Business is booming. Also, what's up with your fish? Uh, they're beta fish, Sonny, so they aren't supposed to be put together, but I put them together anyway and watch them fight. Ooh, the survival of the fittest. Bro, they are tweaking. <sighs> I'm just gonna sit back, relax, and watch some TV, though. Same here. President Crafton ordered all the birds removed, but now they're furious and seeking revenge by trying to poop on him. We will need two bodyguards to try and save President Crafton's reputation on the Today Speaking to the Public. Sonny, this is our opportunity to make the big bucks! We'll prove ourselves as the most worthy bodyguards in Minecraft. We'll save the president from those pooping birds! Let's go! Mr. President, have no fear, cause Sonny and Melon are here. Thank you, boys. I'm so glad to see you. Make sure those birds can't poop on me while I deliver my speech. It would be a real shame if my reputation was ruined. Don't worry, Mr. President. We'll protect your dignity. Now, Melon, we've got to eliminate the birds. And they're swarming everywhere! Eliminate them! Kill them! Take them out, Sonny! They're pooping on me! This is disgusting. They're pooping everywhere, bro. At least we have other bodyguards with us! Look at the civilians! They're helping! Let's go! Take these birds out! Nobody wants to be pooped on! Come on, come on! We have to finish the mission! Protect the Prezi. Did we take out all the birds? There's a lot of floating poop though, Sonny. What if a stray one catches Mr. President? Don't let that happen, Melon. Whatever it takes. We'll catch the poop with our face if we need to. I will! Catch all the poop! That one is going intergalactic. Where is it off to? I think we did it though, Sonny. It doesn't look like any poop reached Mr. President Crafton. We're good. We're heroes. Thank you, boys. Take your Medal of Honor for your fine work today. Melon, we're heroes. Oh, and President Crafton, uh, where's our payment? Yeah, how about some money? Only honor. Only honor? Bro, good luck defending yourself. I'm out of here. Yeah, next time there's birds trying to poop on you, you're on your own. Uh, Dr. Longbottoms, what are you doing here? I'm here to kill the president. Uh, Sonny, this sounds like the president's problem. He's not even paying us. Yeah, and the wither just killed Longbottoms. His own experiment backfired. Longbottoms and the president are two peas in a pod. Let's let them battle. Yep, we've got body bodyguard business to attend to. That's right. Our bodyguard business is protecting our channel. Please press that subscribe button right now. Finally, I'm at Sonic Land. How's the gang doing? Sonic, Tails, Amy Rose, what's going on here? We're just enjoying the lovely weather. Want to go collect some rings later? Yeah, Sonic, that'd be so much fun. Uh, how do I get as fast as you, though? Oh, no. What do you mean, oh, no? I just asked you a question. I didn't think it was that big of a deal. Melon, behind you. What are you talking about? Oh no, Dr. Robotnik, what are you doing here? Now, Melon, you will become Shin Sonic. I will become Shin Sonic. Become Shin Sonic. Become Shin Sonic. I will become Shin Sonic. What do I do, Dr. Robotnik? Now, my minion. First, what we need to do is kill the president of Minecraft, Crafton. Sonic gang, you're coming with. <sighs> this has been such a relaxing day all by myself at home. Playing some video games, watching some TV, just enjoying the day. Wait, who's here? President Crafton? What's going on? Sonny, you have been assigned by the Minecraft government for a special protect the president task. Shin Sonic will try to kill me and you need to stop him. You're my last hope. Bro, how does that even happen? This world was peaceful moments ago. And you're saying that Shin Sonic's coming to kill you? Yes, Sonny. And you're all I have left. Oh, I guess that makes sense. That's why you have no bodyguards, huh? Take this, Sonny, and use it to protect me. Also, you should probably secure your house. Thank you, President Crafton. I'll use this gear to protect you with my life. Now, why don't you head on inside my house? I'll try and secure it a bit more to keep you safe. Thank you, Sonny. President Crafton, you should be safe in here. I barricaded the house just a little bit by installing these maximum security blinds. Trust me, it'll work. My army, it's time. We've assembled around President Crafton's house, and now we will invade. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Go and attack already! Oh no. 
know. It's Shin Sonic. He's so cursed and tiny. Gross, gross, gross. Get away from my house. I'll protect the president. Oh, you messed up. You messed up. Destroy him, mommy. As long as I keep them away from the president, it'll be fine. I'll hold them back with my life. Die. This is insane. I've never seen an army this big. How, how are you not dead? Die. Army. Sonic. No, I can't eat my golden apples. There's too many of them. Kill them. Kill them. Kill them. Run. Run. Keep them distracted. Eat the gapples. Yes. Destroy. Feast upon the sunny. This is ridiculous. There are so many of these creatures. What happened to them? I can't believe believe Shin Sonic summoned this many clones. I'll even help a little bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's too many clones. It's okay, though. I have a backup plan. I just got to bring them over here to my big ball of TNT and light it. I got to go swim. Clones retreat. Retreat. My army. <sighs> I can't believe that actually worked. I got rid of them all. Shin Sonic, you're next. No, no, I've got to retreat. I've got to retreat. I'll be back. I'll be back. That filthy, slimy Shin Sonic. He thinks he'll be back to eliminate President Crafton. But when he returns, I'll be ready. President Crafton, great news. We won the battle, but the war is still yet to come. Good job, Sonny. You need to prepare because Shin Sonic will be back and more powerful than ever. I'll add some sentry turrets to help protect us, and I'll fortify the house with a new barrier. Let me gather these supplies. Here we go. I'll even upgrade my weapon a little. Ooh, some grenades. Don't mind if I do. Time to take these sentries, though. Mr. Crafton, I'll place this one next to you just in case. And now, I will defend this house with every sentry at my disposal. It'll kill whatever Shin Sonic throws our way. And if it doesn't, well, I don't have any more backup plans. I'm all out of TNT. Which is why I'll fortify the house with this. Oh no, not this dirt. With this. Some obsidian. This will help keep the president safe. I've just got to create the barrier. This will block out any enemies that come our way. As long as they can't jump more than two blocks tall. And that'll have to do. Well, I'm tired. I gotta take a nap. Ah! What the heck was that? President Crafton, we're under attack! What are these things? What are these things? And my turrets, they're not helping! Oh no! It's because these are cyborgs, just like the turrets! You're going down, Sonny. I told you I would be back! This is crazy. I can't believe Shin Sonic can summon these types of cyborgs! Not good. Not good. I've gotta gapple up quick! Die! I'll lead them away from town! That's the best I could do for the president right now. Follow me, you idiots! I gotta lead them away from town. Ooh, thanks for the boost, buddy! And then, at the lighthouse, I can grab a secret weapon. You idiots! What are you doing? Kill the president! Why are you shooting at me? Here it is. The secret chest. The minigun. And a ton of ammunition. This is what I need! Load up! Oh no, those minions, they stopped chasing me. I gotta get to the president quick. Well, if you wanna do something right, you gotta do it yourself. Time to kill the president. I'll stop you, Shin Sonic! Back up! Back up! Oh no, oh no, he's got a minigun! Kill them all. Kill them all! I won't let these cyborgs touch the president! Destroy him! <laughs> these Robotnik clones can't do nothing! Die! Oh, this is not good. He's killing everything with a minigun. I'm out of here. I'll be back! Oh no, there's still these! My sentries, if only they helped! Two hours later. <gasps> President Crafton, are you okay, sir? That was insane. Yes, Sonny, I'm fine. Thanks for protecting me. Those cyborgs were insane. I know. That was absolutely brutal. I'm just glad you're safe. Don't worry, Sonny. You bought me enough time. My maximum security is ready. Let's move on. It's just inside the mountain. You're the goat, President Crafton. Let's go. Dr. Robotnik, Sonny keeps foiling our plans. I need to do it myself. All your robots are too stupid. Well, I'll make you stronger then. Thank you, Dr. Robotnik. With this power, I'll destroy the president. The president is currently deep inside this secured facility. I'm here at the first layer of defense. If that stinking Shin Sonic shows up, I'll activate this lever and cook him in lava. Plus, I got these robots who can help me out now. After I killed all those cyborgs, I was able to repurpose their parts and craft some new ones. Only now, they're on the good guy's team. 
Ew, gross. There's that Shin Sonic again. <laughs> but if he walks forwards, he's finished. I can smell the president. <laughs> ah! Ah, what is this? I'm burning! I'm burning! Get out of here, Shin Sonic! Oh, no. It's back. You can't stop me. I'll keep coming and coming. Not good. I gotta slow him down. The president's working on an antidote to take the Shin Sonic morph off of Melon. Take that. Yes. He fell for the trap. And now I gotta move to the next secured layer. If I don't get there before Shin Sonic, it's gonna be a disaster. Uh, darn that, Sonny. He's a clever one. But now, I'll make it through this layer of security. Nothing will stop me from killing Krafton. Not even my own robots. Die. Die. Okay, goats. I made it to the next secure layer. I gotta keep an eye out for Shin Sonic Melon. Whenever he shows up, I'll kill him. Oh, those Eggman pests were a little bit annoying. But your security is no match for me. Come on, sentries. Kill this guy. I'm too quick for your sentries. Plus, I have mad parkour skills. Yeah, well, look behind you, Shin Sonic. How about... Oh, he's dead. <laughs> The defense actually worked. I'm alive. Oh, hey, boss. What are you doing here? Ow! That's not your boss. That is an evil clone that President Crafton created to defeat you, Shin Sonic. Well, wouldn't he be a good clone then? Yeah, that's, that's what I meant. He's a good guy clone, but he's evil because he's going to kill you. And, you know, I'm going to kill you too. No. No! Dang this guy. He keeps coming back. Crafton will fall. Crafton will fall. Ow! Just like I fell in that lava. Dang it. I've got to get to the next secured layer and protect President Crafton. Ow. That's it. I'm going across now. I'm far quicker than before. Okay, goats. I'm in position. If Shin Sonic shows up here, I'll blast him. Oh, no. There he is. Die. Ow. 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 You're a dead man, Sonny. You're a dead man. You can never get to me, Shin Melon. And now I don't have a lot of time. I got to go and protect the president quick. Urgh, darn that, Sonny. Repurposing all of Eggman's technology to defend this silly president. Why does he even care about the president that much anyways? Doesn't really do much. Don't worry, President Crafton. I'll protect you at all costs. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, maybe I won't have to do too much. No, Sonny. Every time the Shin Sonic dies, he gets stronger. There's only one way to defeat him, and it's with the antidote. Okay, President. Do you have it yet? Not yet, but it's almost ready. Give me one more minute, Sonny. <sighs> This time I'm really mad. This, these robots won't stop me. I'm faster, stronger. Oh no, he's pushing through. I'll grenade everything. Blow up the blocks. Stop him. You can't stop me anymore, Sonny. Uh, cover it with dirt. Cover it with dirt. President Crafton, we don't have a lot of time. Give me the antidote. Dang, your stupid robots. I can't break the dirt. Sonny, here's the antidote. It's ready. Thank you, President Crafton. I'll use the anti-shin sonic on Melon. Sonny, how are you? I won't let you touch the president! Whoa, Sonny, what happened to me? What's going on? It worked! President Crafton, we undid the shin sonic curse. Melon's back to normal. Uh, someone want to explain what's going on here? Uh, don't worry about it, but all the viewers should subscribe, though. Today in Minecraft Hide and Seek, I built a secret base to hide from my creepy fangirl. Actually, I was the creepy fangirl. <laughs> hey, Sonny, there's someone at the door who wants to see you. Wait, no! I thought I was controlling the crazy fangirl. Quickly, press the like button to make her go away. Oh, yes, Melon. It's a beautiful day to enjoy the mega yacht. Check this out, Sonny. I'm going to make the most beautiful dive you've ever seen. There won't even be a splash. Oh, yeah? Go for a swim. Dang it, Sonny. What's wrong with you? It was going to be perfection. Yeah? What were you going to swan dive into the best day of your life? Yes, I was. The weather is so beautiful out today and everything is just going perfectly. Way to go and ruin it! Are you kidding me? What the heck? Melon, let's go inside and play some hide and seek. Yeah, bro, I don't want to get wet. Bro, you're literally a watermelon. Water's in your name, meaning you're always wet, bro. Yeah, but on the inside, not on the outside. I don't want my rind getting all moist. Ew, don't say that word. What? Moist? Ah! That's it. I'm gonna go find something to do without 
without you. Wait, Sonny, don't leave me alone. It's scary. I don't like thunder. Oh, Melon, that was scary. Sonny, I'm really scared right now. What are we going to do? There's only one thing we can do at a time like this, and that's play hide and go seek. And I'm hiding first. Wait, no, I, w I don't want to be alone. No. Spooky thunderstorm. Oh. Shut up, Sonny. That's not nice. Well, give me my two-minute countdown so I can start hiding. I've been counting, Sonny. Oh, what number are you on? Banana. Wait, Melon, that's not a number. That's a fruit. <laughs> yeah, maybe for you. Bruh. All right. What is 35 in Fruitarian? Orange. Dang it! All right. I got to find my hiding spot quickly. Okay, guys. I've got something to confess. And it's not that the GameCube is the best console of all time. It's that I've got a secret hiding spot. Check this out. If I just stumble my way over here and flick this. You could see I have one-way glass and a secret base. Let me just cover that back up. We're gonna go down, flick this so that it's covered. And now I could spy on Melon from underneath the house. There's no way he's gonna find me. And I have these really hilarious traps set up. Check this out. When I flick the lever, it makes a funny voice. Ah, what was that voice? What was that sound? See, I told you this is awesome. And then I've even got some music if I want to play something creepy when Melon's looking for me. And I've got them scattered all around the house. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Look at this idiot. <laughs> He's right above me. Uh, all right, Sonny. Uh, first question, are you hiding upstairs or downstairs? I would argue that I'm hiding downstairs yeah <laughs> okay okay i'll come downstairs then second question are you closer to the kitchen side of the house or let's say uh, the library section of the house i would say the library section yeah we'll go with the library hey guys it's time to start trolling melon hello ah, what was that what was that oh, that was not sunny's voice guys i don't like this i really don't like this i want to consume watermelon no what Watermelons are not for eating. Calm down. Calm down. Okay, guys, that was pretty good. Now I'm gonna follow Melon over here and play some creepy music underground. Guys, why do I hear some creepy sounds below me? What the heck is going on? And then I'm gonna add the voice lines again. Melon, I will eat your juicy insides. Guys, I'm really scared. I'm really scared. I don't like this. I don't like this. What is happening? It's getting closer. <laughs> What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Sonny, this is not cool, bro. I don't like what you're doing. Well, why don't you just ask some questions to help find me? Okay, third question. Uh, why do I hear sounds below me? I'm not too sure. I'm not hearing any sounds myself. Guys, I'm totally lying. I can hear the sounds. <laughs> but I'm gonna trick Mel into thinking it's all in his head. You're telling me this is all in my head, Sonny? There's no way. There's no way. <sighs> Wait, what's all in your head, Melon? Calm down. What's going on? There's gotta be ghost blocks here. What is this? Why are all the blocks on the floor one-way glass? Guys, this isn't good. I need to scare him by using the ghost voice again. Guys, there's a lever and a disc. Ah! Ah! What is this sound? Wait, it's coming from the speakers. If I just break these speakers... Yo! There's no more voices! But there's still this creepy music. That's it. I'm coming down. I'm coming down! Guys, Melon's gonna try and find my hiding spot. He just destroyed the music disc. That's it. Creepy voices, play! Wait, why do I still hear the creepy voices? I destroyed the speakers! This makes no sense. Sonny, I know you're in here. I know you're in here. Melon, what are you talking about, bro? I'm in the house. What's going on? I knew this wasn't in my head. I knew this wasn't in my head. What is in your head? You scumbag! Dang it! I was trying to troll you. Check this out, bro. All over the house, I could play this creepy voice. Hello. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. Turn that off. Turn that off. Sorry, this is not cool, bro. You convinced me I was going crazy or getting haunted. I'll remember this in the next round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever you say. It's impossible for you to go crazy because you're already a mad melon. Okay, melon, it's your turn to go hide. You've got two minutes. All right, Shani, that's fine. <laughs> that's plenty of time to find my hiding spot. Guys, is he an idiot? He literally just left the secret bunker of one-way glass and he's gonna go hide above me. Bruh is missing brains. Guys, there's gotta be some other secrets to this house somewhere, like maybe in this fireplace or in this TV. <laughs> yes! Yo, goats, this guy is so dumb. I'm watching him discover his hiding spot. He's gonna go hide inside of the television, but he's forgot 
on and I could see everything. He really should have activated his fifth melon seed. Guys, I might be a genius. Who else would think there's a secret door in the TV? All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Okay, just in time. You only had 10 seconds left. Now, let's see. If I was a Wandermelon, where would I hide? Maybe upstairs somewhere? Yeah, bro, that's my first question. Are you hiding upstairs? Uh, I mean, define upstairs. Did you go up a staircase and hide on the second story of the house? No, I did not. Okay, guys, the only reason I'm even asking these questions is to throw him off the trail so he doesn't realize how dumb he is and that I cheated and could see where he was hiding. Okay, Melon, very good, very good. Second question. Ooh, these mirrors look pretty suspicious. Did you jump and hide behind a magical mirror? No, Sonny, that is stupid. Okay, guys, I'm gonna keep asking dumber and dumber questions. All right, Melon, for my third and final question. I just have a really good feeling about this. Did you perhaps go all the way upstairs into the second floor, look into the magic mirror on the walls, then see a toilet, get super obsessed with the toilet, open it up, sit on it, and flush yourself? Sonny, that might be the dumbest question I've ever heard. No. Uh, I, I'm so weirdly specific and not even close to where I'm hiding. Dang it! I thought for sure you were in the sewage! Uh, okay, okay. Time for me to figure this out then. If you're not upstairs and you're not in a toilet or the sewer system, according to my calculations, there's only one other place you could possibly be hiding. How did you find me? Bro, everyone knows televisions have a secret spot. Guys, comment down below if you knew that. I don't think that's a thing. Why do you think they call it Plasma TV? I, I don't know. I don't know either, actually. All right, Sonny, I have no idea how you... Oh. How I did what? <laughs> how did I forget about that? <laughs> you are so smart, bro. It's impressive. Okay, give me my two minutes. I gotta go find my hiding spot. You've got two minutes, Sonny. I swear if you hide in the basement again, I will destroy you. I'm not gonna do that. Why would I want to play creepy voices again? That would be cringe. Okay, guys, I have two minutes to find the ultimate hiding spot, so I think I'll spend the first minute soaking up the hot tub. Oh, yeah, that feels good on my skin. Mm-mm-mm, that's cozy. And then I'm gonna go to my hiding spot. Check this out. I've got another epic secret spot here on the mega yacht. If I just go right underneath this door, you can see I have another secret one-way glass bunker. So let's cover it back up, open up the trap door, and descend into the depths. Yes, this is perfect. Melon will never suspect a thing. Oh, and I have another another doohickey that plays creepy voices. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Um, all right, Sonny, time to track you down using my fifth melon seed. Hmm. Judging by the footsteps you left, you must be upstairs, am I correct? You are not mm -hmm. correct, sir. I'm not upstairs. I don't even think I'm in the home anymore. Thank you for the added information. I knew that. I'll just debate that out. Now that I know you're not inside, you must be aboard the yacht. Uh, I'm not sure how you deduced that? I could be in the swimming pool. I could be in the yard. I could be anywhere. I could even be on the rooftop. Nope, you, you're in the yacht. Okay, fine. You got me. I'm in the yacht. That's two questions. No, that wasn't a question. That was merely a statement. But you answered it regardless. And because it was merely a statement, I'm probably lying to you. Mm, no, you're not that intelligent. There's only one way you could confirm it, and that would be by asking the question, am I in the yacht? No, I'm good. I will unconfirm to find you later. Okay, guys. He thinks he's clever. He thinks he's clever. Time to scare him. Oh my days. What are these songs you are playing? Okay, Sonny, on a reel. This is really creepy. I don't like what you're doing. <laughs> and you haven't even heard the most scary thing of them all. Hey, uh, Melon, I love you. Wait, no, not a crazy fan, girl. Don't tell me that's sunshine. Sonny, what are you doing? You're messing with powers beyond your control. That's not sunshine. It's actually the craziest fangirl of them all. Melancholy. Ah, no, not a melon fangirl. I must find you quick, Sonny. I cannot endure this much longer. Good luck with that, because I am in a top secret hiding spot. Melancholy, activate. <laughs> Stop it, Sonny. That's it. 
That's it. I know you must be hiding below the ship. Yeah, how would you figure that one out? Is it perhaps the one-way glass I've got hidden again? <laughs> Wait, you got more one-way glass? No way. No way. You are the stupidest sometimes. You know that? Sonny, there's no way you would just tell me that. I mean, you can just right-click the blocks. I'm right-clicking blocks. I don't see any one-way glass. Oh, well, that's fortunate for me then. Hiding. I've got to find this entrance. Yeah, you've got to find this entrance. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder where it is. Uh, why is there a tripwire here, Sonny? I don't know. It's probably melancholy. Trying to trap me, I see. Oh, wait. No, it's the crazy fangirl. Uh, hey, Sonny. Oh, I just gotta find my way in there, and it's over for you. Yeah, good luck with that one. Guys, I gotta move. I gotta move. Close this and this. Ooh, I'm goaded. <laughs> Sonny, wait. I found the ladder. I found the ladder. You're done, Sonny. You're done, Sonny. That's where the crazy fangirl lives. Where are you? Where are you, Sonny? I am the commander of this yachta. I just heard some glass break. Where are you? I'm the admiral of this ship, bro. That's where. What do you mean you're the admiral? Ah! Ah! Get over here! You've got 10 seconds! I've just got to punch you. And I win! Yes! Dang it, bro. Whatever. You thought you could scare me. And now it's, it's the fifth melon seed activation. Okay, fine. Activate your fifth melon Ooh. seed. You got two minutes to hide. I'm gonna count right here. One, two, three crazy fangirls. Five, 17, 82. Oh, Melon, you only have 18 seconds left. I'm counting to 100. 83, 84. Okay, guys, Sonny wants to cheat, but little does he know, I am the master of cheating. Gale, set size, set with 0 0.1. Yes. Yes. I am super skinny now. Check me out. I'm practically 2D. Now, just gotta hide somewhere where he'd never find me. And you think he'd notice me right here? Maybe he would. Maybe it's not quite the best disguise. Wait, guys. I've got a genius idea. Bada bing, bada boom. And now, I merely disguise myself with the melon. I'm practically undetectable. All right, so... Sonny, I'm ready. 99, 100. Perfect timing. Okay, let's see here. If I was a wee little watermelon trying to activate my fifth melon seed, according to my calculations, carry the two, multiply it by 69. Yep, I would be hiding underneath the house using Sonny's secret spot. So let's investigate. Melon, you're probably down here. Well, is that your question, Sonny? No, I was just talking to myself because I really like like to hear my voice. Okay, sounds good, sounds good. Okay, first question, are you hiding in this secret base somewhere? No, I'm not. Dang it! Okay, second question, are you hiding in a secret spot? Uh, I wouldn't say it's a secret spot. Why are you saying it like that? I just wouldn't say it's a secret spot, Sonny, that's all. But you could have just said, no, it's not a secret spot, but you're saying, I wouldn't call it a secret spot. Why those particular words in that particular order, huh, Melon? That sounds suspicious. Quite fishy, some might have had. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's up, Sonny? Nothing. I think I just, I think I just saw the funniest thing I've ever seen. Yo, guys, look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Guys, I think he's onto me. I've got to do something now. Oh, dude, there's something in his kitchen. I think someone farted and it's like laughing gas. I can't stop. I can't stop. <laughs> guys, I got to change my height. I've got to shrink. I've got to shrink. He's like a pancake, guys. Like, what is he? <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> Melon, Melon, what did you do? You activated your fifth melon seed and you became flatter than a pancake. Sonny, I don't know what you're talking about. You never found me. <laughs> I literally saw you run away. Now, where is he hiding? You made yourself super tiny. Where'd you go? Nowhere, Sonny. Don't worry about it. If you don't tell me where you're hiding, I'm gonna ask Melancholy, the craziest fangirl of them all, to join our next video. Uh... Anything for the hiding seek dub really you're gonna hold out for that okay let's see where's this tiny little melon last question then where did you run after you shrunk yourself down i would say the room with the blue
blue beds and the speakers and uh oh you are in here huh gamecube looks sus but you're not there you have 30 seconds left sonny wait are you in the compost bin somehow Is he in here no what the heck where did you go i cannot say this is so weird i don't understand there's no way he could be hiding hello tiny little melon 10 seconds left sonny what the heck there's nothing left you could hide in i've checked all the one-way glasses. Well, there's nothing down here. Five, four, three, two, one. Good game, Sonny. What? You were there? Yep, see ya. Wait, there's a secret passage? Oh my god. <laughs> the Deberton has been secured. Whatever, bro. It was worth the laugh. When you were up against this watermelon thinking you were invisible, it was so funny. Yeah, I honestly don't know how you found me, bro. I was blended in perfect no dude you were pretty obvious and you looked like a pancake and if you guys love pancakes make sure you like and subscribe this is minecraft hide and seek but i have an insane secret spot uh guys i can't find sunny anywhere please like the video right now to make him teleport to me <laughs> i found you hey yo what no melon are you ready for hide and seek brother Let's do this, sonny! I'm too cold! Oh, uh, oh, chill. Chill, sonny, can we talk about this really quick? Okay, yeah, really quick. You have two seconds. No, 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 can I have five seconds? Five, four, three, two, one! Get over here, Melon! I just want to splatter you! Stay away! Oh, wait, there's a diamond here. I gotta grab it. Sorry, I got distracted. Yeah, good luck, buddy. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> I don't need luck where I'm going because I'm hiding first, bro. Get inside of the diamonds and start to count. You've got two minutes. Okay, I'll get inside. You can't kill me inside. You can't kill me. You weren't inside, but you are now. Take this diamond and give me my two-minute warning. Uh, two-minute warning. Okay. Thanks, Melon. Stay away. Stay away. <laughs> oh, it's too fun, though. If you kill a man in his blindfold, you lose automatically. I don't make the rules. Okay, okay. But how will you know it's me if I killed you. Uh, I can read the chat after. But you're blindfolded. You can't read anything. Shut up. You got two minutes. All right. I'm giving you the power. You're cold now. Ice cold. Okay, guys. I got two minutes to hide and I've wasted a lot of my time already. So I got to go in creative and I'm going all the way up. Literally, I'm going to fly up here and one of these clouds. Let me find the secret block. I placed it before we even started hide and seek. Is it this one? This one looks a bit suspicious. Is it this one? No. Is it this one? Which block is it? Dang it. There's so many and it's so well blended. I can't even remember which one is the secret scale block. Maybe it's uh this one. This is how secret and hidden my spot is. I can't even find it myself. Bro. All right. I'll get a fresh scale blocker if you insist and I'll put it right here. Look at that. You seriously cannot tell a difference from far. You have to get so close up if you want to see it. And then I just go like this and go inside of it. And I got to decorate these walls really fast or Melon's going to see me. Light gray glass. Perfect. And then we just got to fill this all the way. Yeah, I think I'm going to do this a bit quicker. We're going to break that block, grab the corner, fly over here. This is so weird. I'm inside of a tidy block. And over here. And then I'm going to go outline. Light gray. I don't want to do shulker boxes. That would be awkward. And stained glass. Boom. Oh, yes. Look at this. I am perfectly blended. Maximum camouflage. And now I just go in survival, clear the old inventory, and tell that dummy, I'm ready, Melon. Finally, time to take this blindfold off. Oh, got a burp. Uh, 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 <clears throat> Dude, stop being so gross. We'll see about that, Sonny. <laughs> Your name tag's showing, bro. I'm... Oh, wait. That's DJ. Wait, what the heck? Who is this, bro? We got a DJ in the stew. Yo, don't play with my homie right there, all right? He's the one with the music. Bro, this guy is jamming. Please don't stop the music. Music. Oh, guys, by the way, I can see the entire map from my hiding spot. This is awesome. So I can just spy on Melon. Yo, Sonny. Sonny, first.
first question, uh, out of the four biomes, which one are you hiding in? Let me just do a quick analysis of my surroundings, and yeah, look at that. It turns out I'm in none of them. Bro, what? Wait, that means you're either in the sewers or up high. Second question, would you say you're in a place of high elevation or low elevation? I would say that I have a pretty high latitude and longitude. I don't know why I said it like that. Let's go! <laughs> Uh, now I'm going all the way. Yo, chill, Melon. Now, where are you, Sonny, bro? Are you doing something funky, spunky like in this helicopter? Huh? Yeah, bro. Don't go in the helicopter. And definitely don't go in the spawn platform. Dude, there's no way. You can't get up to the spawn platform unless you're cheating. No, and we could use creative whenever we go to hide. So it's okay. All right, dude, that's crazy. I have the power of creative mode. Whoa. You're not even up there. I know, bro. I just wanted you to waste your time. Dude, you are such a troll. <laughs> Yo, guys. Where are you hiding? You gotta be up here somewhere. He just jumped right over my head. Bro, I swear this block just despawned. What the heck? Is it this one that despawned? Uh, uh wait. Uh, this block looks a little bit weird, Sonny. Does it? I don't, I don't think it does. I really don't think it does. Bro, you rascal. You didn't even get the slime blocks. This is how you do it. What? That's not slime blocks? <laughs> yeah, it's just a normal car. Where'd you go? Sonny, you won't get away. I'm invisible. What the heck? Where did you go? You'll never find me, Melon. My hiding spots are too goaded. Uh, what happened? <laughs> Let's go. Dang it. You smacked me with the ice, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm just that goat like that. And now it's your turn to seek, Sonny. I'm giving myself two minutes to hide and... In peace. What the heck? Give me the ice cube back. Thank you. Okay, guys, I've got the perfect spot to hide. If Sonny wants to mess around with these scale boxes, let's mess around with these scale boxes. Little bit of parkour, guys. Trust me. Totally legit parkour. Definitely not doing this or anything like that. Give myself a scale box. Hmm. What scale do I want to go for? I think I'm going to go for a nice 16 scale gray box. Plop it right in this corner. Actually, no, no, no. let's go for the 32 scale box. Place it right in the corner. And look at that. You can barely see it. Now I just gotta fly in somehow. Uh, no. I have to uh, uh, break some stuff. Here we go. And replace this concrete. Fall in, please. Yes, there we go. Hold on, this is still a little messed up. I'm gonna have to go back to creative. I'm so slow. Uh, let's just place this door here. Give ourselves a ghost block. Place this block down. Enter spectator mode. And now I enter my scale box. <laughs> yes, bro. I'm practically invisible in this spot. Good luck getting me, Sonny. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Okay, bro, I can't see. I gotta take this blindfold off. Uh, uh, achoo! Yeah, that thing was too itchy. It was giving me allergies. <laughs> no, Melon. You think just because there's name tags and texts all over this map that I won't find you? Oh, you got another thing coming. Nah, bruh. I kind of want to wear this. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm good in my spot. Bruh, I'm gonna be dirty this round. I'm gonna beat you over my hot fire. Get it? Because I'm a grass block with a magma block. A dirty fire. Yeah, all right. Oh, I thought because you were the sun. Nah, bruh. I'm just coming to beat you up, all right? I'm gonna plant you back in the ground like a real melon. Eh, what if I don't want to be planted? Huh? What are you gonna do then? Huh? Too bad, bro. You were born in the ground and I will bury you in the ground. Uh, well, uh, actually, I... Oh, my... <laughs> Look at this doofus, bro. <laughs> Look at him. He looks so dumb. He's literally wearing a grass block. Melon, my first question for you is going to be, are you currently located inside or outside? Ooh, that is a very interesting spectacle. If I divide by the quantum realm and decide I'm inside. Thank you, bro. I thought you were going to try and waste my time and then I was going to have to get really angry. And you! And
And, uh, side note, Melon, before I go in the sewers, the sewers counts as what? Inside or outside? That's definitely inside, bro. Is it? Because it's kind of like poopy and poop belongs outside. Uh, I, do you poop outside? Yeah, bro. Every day. You don't use a toilet ever? Nah, bro. I'm allergic to toilets. I keep it fresh. I go in the great outdoors, find myself a nice bush, and I just poop right there. Dang, you keep it real, Sonny. Uh... Well, I, I don't even know. What, what what was the question? Uh, I didn't actually ask a question. I was just trying to bait out free information. Yo, give me this one. Hold on, hold on. I gotta swap up. Let me take this one right here. Yes. Oh, they see me creeping from my shadow. This is not good. I threw my diamond and it's stuck right next to my block. But it's too big. I can't pick it up. No. Going downstairs. Hey, Melon. Can you give me an ah, oh, man, if you see me? Ah, oh, man. Wait, you can see me right now? What the heck? He's in here. He's in You're not in a barrel, are you? Are you in one of these stupid barrels? Guys, it's not good. He's gonna see the diamond. What is this under underneath the TV? Oh, what the heck just happened? I grabbed the diamond. Let's go. I clutched up. What is this, Melon? What is what? What is down here? Yo, secret underneath the television. No way, bro. You found a secret? Yeah, and there's weird candles down here in these prison cells. What is this? Is it my birthday or something? Uh, no, but it is my birthday. So for my birthday, I minus one question from you. What? <laughs> Why? What? I didn't agree to this. Anyways, I'm gonna ask my next question. Which of the four quadrants are you hiding in? Uh, the big house one. Are you kidding me? I've been exploring the big house this whole time. Yeah, buddy. Okay, you're inside the big house. Uh, and you only have one minute left. So you're inside of the big house. The question is where? <gasps> okay, last question. Are you using a scale box to try and cheat? Because I used one. Potentially. Yo, are you underneath one of these trap doors? In a secret scale block? Come on. Uh, something like that. Okay, guys, I'm gonna drop a diamond right below. Just to give him a chance. You know, I feel bad. I feel bad. Please don't. No, it happened again. No. Oh, this is not good, guys. Melon, what happened again? Uh, uh, nothing happened again. Don't worry about it. Dude, are you in one of these barrels under the bed? I don't understand where you went. You only have 30 seconds left. Yeah, and you know what the viewers have? Three seconds to hit that like and subscribe button. Boom. Bring it. Oh, what the heck? No, no. Let me back in, please. Oh, that's it. I'm going downstairs. There's no way you're in this bedroom. Where are you hiding, Melon? Guys, I'm going to troll him again. You got 15 seconds left, buddy. Wait, is that a secret spot up here? Yeah, it's secret, bro. It's super secret. Wait, there is a door up here on the balcony. What is this? Hold on. Hold on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, one. Let me up. Let's go. Wait, Melon, I see you. Wait. Hey, Sonny. Go back in there or die. Oh. Ow. I win, right? No, you did not win, bro. You're trash. There was a diamond hovering there for so long and you didn't see it. Bro, I couldn't see the scale block. It literally doesn't render in until you get super, super close. And there's a freaking light blocking it. This chandelier was in the way. Uh, Sounds like an excuse to me, Sonny. Dude, there's so many secret spots in this room. There's literally trap doors leading to the roof, a secret tunnel under the television, all kinds of secret trap doors in every room. But you were just in a corner on top of the chimney? Yep. Okay, Melon, it's your turn to count. Take all of these blocks. You think you're too cold? I'm gonna melt you. Yo, you got two minutes side. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Oh, man. Get me out of here. 159, 158. 156, 157, 156, 155, 154. Which way are you counting, up or down? I count both ways, Sonny. I count two down, then one up, and then four down, and then two up. It's just the way I count. That's good, that gives me extra time. I appreciate that. Okay, goats, I gotta find a really good hiding spot this round. So the question is, what do I want to do? This marketplace is so goaded. <laughs> look, look at all this stuff right here. Yo, hold up. Let me get full netherite on so Melon can't kill me anymore anymore. There we go. And 
the boots. Oh, I look good and schnazzy. And then I think I'm gonna put a scale block somewhere super impossible to find me. Perhaps right here, underneath this barrel. So let's grab ourselves one scale block color brown. Put it in there. Awesome. Then I'm gonna grab some trap doors. Yo, one-way glass trap doors. Are you kidding me? This is awesome. Let's grab the chocolate bar version. And then I need to somehow like place this in. How am I gonna do this? I go down. I go up. Oh, I go down some more. I go up. Yeah, there we go. And then can I place a block here or is this, this is not gonna work, is it? Let's see what this looks like. Oh, this hiding spot is goat mode. Then I'm gonna put a grass block there. Can you open these? You can't even open them. Yo, there's no way Melon's gonna find me. He's gonna be so confused too. He's gonna see this and be like, why won't it open? Why won't it open? And then to really mess with him, I'm gonna put a real trap door like this. <laughs> it's like double trap door. Trap doorception. And now spectator mode. Fly into my scale block. And I think I'm ready. And you know what else I could do it here if I wanna be extra sneaky? I can lie down. Look at me crawling around like a little snail. Oh, I look weird. Yo, I'm multiplying. Why am I multiplying? What the heck is going on? That was weird. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. Time to find you, Shani. First question, are you using one of those annoying scale boxes again? Uh, <laughs> yes. Bruh, this eight scale box hide and seek. Well, actually, I guess it is at this point. Bruh, this is secret spot hide and seek. And the scale boxes give you the ultimate secret hiding places. All right, Sonny. Second question. Out of the four biomes, if you had to pick one of the biomes and walk into that biome, of all the four biomes of the four biomes that are four, which one are you hiding in? The biome that's the most biome, like the biome I'm bioming in? Yeah. It's the one with all the shops. Yo, let's go. Now I just gotta look for your stupid scale box in here. Yeah, it's gonna be a little more tricky than that one, Melon. Bro, does this go to the sewers too? Sonny, I swear if you're in the sewers. Bro, I like the sewers. It's poopy down here. Bro, this goes right- Oh my, I gotta fly out now, dude. Doesn't even work. I'm just harvesting fertilizer for you so that you can grow up to be the strongest Wandermelon. Mmm, that is so kind of you, Shani. Yeah, mostly I just want to watch you eat poop. What the heck was that invisible block? Bro, it... What is that? What is what? Bro, there's some weird blocks in here. Give me these diamonds, though. Give me them diamonds. Yeah. Melon, you're scaring me. You're scaring me. I'm just hidden away in a secret spot. It's nothing scary. Whoa. I think I found your secret spot, honey. Honey? Yo, chill. That's sus. I meant, I meant Sunny. I meant Sunny, bro, not honey. Sus, bro. Dude, you know what I meant, man. I know I am kind of sweet sometimes. Nah, you're always uh, hot, like annoying. Sus, bro. Stop. Yo, where are you? Because, because you're the sun, though. That's like what I meant. All right, I get it. You're making this weird. Just ask me some real questions already. Okay, bro. Out of all the shops, which shop are you closest to? I think the closest shop is, uh, uh, just, just going through my photographic memory, uh, closest shop, it's, uh, the candle shop, yeah, the candle shop, okay, we're good. Take you to the candle shop. <laughs> Where's the candle shop? And then I gotta go back here, guys. Oh, we made it. Wait, where'd I go? Where is this candle shop? Guys, I'm a ghost. I turned into a ghost. Wait, is this the candle shop? Oh, this is the candle shop. Yo, what's around here, bro? Wait, are you even in the shop, Sonny? No, you said closest to it. Bro, what the heck? What? What is this trap door? What's what trap door? Bro, wait, why do I see a little yellow pixel through this trap door? Wait, how do you see any yellow pixels? Why is there a trap door in a trap door? What is this? Yo, what? Yo, chill! Chill! Hey, what did I just find, Sonny? Melon, Melon, you need to relax, bro. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, you're burning yourself up. You wasted your sharpness 1000 magma. You think you're safe from me, huh, Sonny? Huh? Little do you know, I know how to crawl too. What? Hey, buddy. No, no, look at me. Look at me. I'm not Sonny. I'm just a ghost. I still got that ice. 
Bruh! You actually made me more ghostly than before. I didn't even think it was possible. What did I do? Look at me. I was white before and now I'm see-through. Uh, bro, Sonny, you're just normal. Uh, not on my screen, bro. <gasps> Ow! All right, bro. I'm gonna give you the TU code and it's my turn. Thanks! Sonny, you interrupted my evil monologue. Now it's my turn to hide, Sonny. And just so you know, there's zero chance of you finding me this round. I have the ultimate hiding spot. Okay, Valen, have fun with that. I like how your villain art turns you into a super nerd. Bro, shut up. Stop, whack! Yeah, that's right. Get your calculator out and go find your secret hiding spot. Oh, you're right. You're going to regret that. Okay, guys. For my super duper secret hiding spot, I'm going to grab myself a scale box. Actually, I'm going to grab myself two scale boxes. And look at this. It doesn't even matter where I start it. Let's just build right outside of this door. <laughs> then I'm going to hop in my first scale box, jump up on the sides and place my second one down come on let me place why isn't this working please this is supposed to be working here we go here we go and there we go now i've what no hey melon good to see you again bro sonny you didn't see anything okay okay just stop slipping and falling dude you can't be dying like that okay guys i need a bigger scale box give me a size eight this should do the trick now i'm gonna build it right back outside again right here shrink down go into my scale box jump up and boom now i've entered my own interdimension bro check it out i can look at tiny version of me it's so trippy and then there's the big version of me bro i'm in my very own dimension let's go all right sonny i'm ready let's do this come on melon 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 i'm gonna find you in world record time world record time first question why is there a scale box entrance owner big man melon right outside of the spawn what, what are you talking about? There's literally this blue thing that says you own it. Why is this here, Melon? Wait, you're not supposed to be able to see that, Sonny. I see it. I have it in my hand. So where the heck are you hiding? You're around here some- Wait a second. You must have built something up in the air. I'm closer than you think, Sonny. What does that even mean, bro? You're up in the air. That's why this broken fell. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You're up here somewhere. Let's go! Melon, I'm gonna find you. Okay, Melon, for my first question, are you up? really high like did you maybe go in the spawn platform um let me ask you a question are you up really high why are you answering my question with a question uh no reason i just need to know i am currently on the helicopter yeah, not anymore. I died. Okay. Well, now I'm at a place of low elevation. What? What do you mean now you're at a place of low elevation? Uh, that's just how it works, Sonny. Okay, I'm going all the way up. Back to the helicopter. And I'm up here. No, I'm, I'm at a high I'm at a high elevation. That doesn't make any sense. You can't just change your location because you feel like it. Uh, I'm not, bro. That's literally where I am. Are you doing some weird thing where you, like, mirror my movement? I don't even understand. What other mods are in this pack? <laughs> bro. Oh, you don't understand the dimension I've entered. Dude, what is what is a what is a finished hoe mold and a wait a second. What is a glass frame and sand buckets? What is this? Guys, I wonder what happens if I throw an item in here. And boom. Yo, wait, why did a creeper head just fly out of my face? Bro, what you got a creeper head? That's really trippy, because I'm seeing a lot of creeper heads right now. Who make the jump? Oh, I missed. That's okay. Shortcut, right? Yeah, dude, I just got a creeper head. What are you doing? Are you using commands right now, Melon? Uh, I don't know, but this is really trippy, bro. I don't understand what's going on. What are you using? I don't know, man. I can't tell you. That's my question. You have to answer it. Uh, Sonny, I don't even know how to answer it. What do you mean? Are you using glass frames? Are you using choker box mods? Like, what the heck are you doing? Uh, <laughs> I don't know, bro. I'm using a scale box. I'll tell you that right now. I'm using more than one scale boxes, bro. If I break glass here, it breaks the glass above me. This is so trippy. Wait, so you're using a scale box? I literally have one that says owner, Big Man Melon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Sonny. Hold on, Melon. I, I, gotta, I gotta ask something here. I'm really confused. Okay, so you're at normal elevation, right? That's what 
you said? Uh, are you at normal elevation? Yeah, I'm at normal elevation. Uh, Melon, I'm also standing in a basketball court. Uh, last question. Are you standing in a basketball court, perhaps? I, I guess technically, yeah. What the heck, bro? How are you attached to me? I'm holding this block. Are you in it? I think technically I'm in that block right now, Sonny. I'm in the hot bar dimension, and you can never find me. What? Uh, hold on. I threw the block out. I'm looking at it. Wait a second. Maybe if I crawl my way inside of it. No, I just pick it back up. Hold on. If I place it. Yo, I see you, Melon. What the heck? No. What have you done? And I see the creeper head. I see the other scale block. I see everything you were doing. Uh, uh, you ran out of time. <laughs> Would you look at that? You're my little pet now. And I'm going to bring you everywhere with me. What did you do? I I broke it and now i have you in the palm of my hand big mistake bro where am i right now guys i'm gonna bring melon way up here he doesn't know what too cold means but soon he'll find out i just need a little bit of ice i'm gonna place him right here oh hey there melon uh what the heck where am i sonny oh don't move a muscle Muscle melon, don't move a muscle. No, Sonny. No, I fell. I told you not to move. That's it. I'm bringing you back. Bro, where am I? What the heck? That's it. I'm moving you again. Boom. Yo, Sonny, chill, chill. <laughs> I control you, melon. You're all mine. No. Hey, melon, you like this? No, Sonny, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it, Sonny. Don't do it. Uh oh, please. I can survive. I can survive. Please. Yes. Wait, I saw a little dot up there still. Uh, I'm back in the hot bar dimension, guys. I'm immortal. What is this? I can't find you, Melon. This is Minecraft hide and seek, but we use secret spot. Dude, what? It's like a whole world in here. And if you guys want to see more secret spots, smash that subscribe button. I hear there's something hiding inside of it. Melon, are you ready for some super secret hiding spots today? I got some plans, brother. Bro, what are you doing? I know you're gonna do something sus this round, aren't you? Always, bro. Otherwise, it's not a secret. Who's this villager? Is this one of your pods? Is it a pod in your scheme? Yo, leave him alone, bro. He's a part of my game. You know what else is part of my game? Uh, what? This hay bale. Hey, Melon. Chill. Chill! Hey, Melon! Stop, stop. You got two minutes. You got two minutes to hide. You're hiding first, you nerd. Get out of here. I'm putting the blindfold on. Whoever has the blindfold is seeking. Wait, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Uh, I don't have it. How do you not have it? I don't have it either. Uh, I'm just gonna go out here and close the door. Okay, Melon, you got two minutes starting now. Good luck. Okay, guys, I've got a little bit of a plan for the first round. So, I'm gonna head into the blacksmith house over over here. Yes, check out my boy, uh, Blacksmithinson. Yeah. He's a blacksmith. That's short for blacksmith. Now, I'm gonna enter a little bit of creative mode and dig myself out a little hole. Yes. Dig this floor out. Yes! Uh, that stuff should be good. Let's dig out this entire floor, bro. This entire house shall be my trap. Now, I grab myself some one Wait, oh, nope, it's, uh, find this. How do I call it? Uh, guys, I'm struggling right now. I know it's in here. Here we go. Got some cobblestone glass. Yo, let me check out all these glasses. Yo, bruh. Okay, okay. I'm gonna grab some cobblestone glass. Where is it? Right here. And now, I place them just like so. Is that? Yeah, that works. That's working. Boom, bada, bing. Oh, wait, I messed up one of them. I messed up one of them. Here we go. Man, you really gotta angle this right. Yes. Construct the floor. And now just to brighten up the place a little bit. Give me my torch. Yes. Yes. It is perfect. And I even have a friend. All right, Sonny. I'm ready. Let's do this. Okay, Melon. I'm leaving the counting zone. Boom. Where's this juicy plump? 
Wondermelon! Let me ask my friend here. Chill! Uh, Mr. Blacksmith, have you perhaps seen a Wondermelon anywhere here? Yeah? You did? Where did he go? Uh, you're not supposed to be talking to the villagers, Sonny. He says he spotted you running through the village, which is completely useless information. Thank you, Blacksmith. Melon, my first question for you. Are you inside or outside? I am potentially, probably, yeah, I'm inside. Ah, oh, thank you, bro. It wasn't that complicated. And now I'm going to just explore a few of these homes. No melons in here. Unless you're doing something really weird with ghost blocks or something. None in there. Bro, there's so many houses in this village. Are you in this chest? No. I feel like you're doing something weird like that, though, where you're hiding in a chest or something. Why would I hide in a chest, Sonny? And how would I even do that? Yo, Melon, I found our dragon head. It was outside of the counting zone. Let me just put this back in here. That was so weird. There it is. Okay, so you're inside. Ah. All right, I'm wasting my second question. Are you inside of one of the villager houses? Uh, kind of, Sonny, but technically no. Wait, so you're kind of in a villager's home? But what do you mean technically no? What does that even mean? Uh, it's you, it just means what it means, all right? You'll understand if you find me. Fine. My third and final question for you, Melon. What type of building are you hiding inside of, you nerd? What does that mean? Please elaborate. No, you can answer the question question. You know exactly what it means. You got villager homes. Fine. I'm in the blacksmith villager house. Let's go. Okay. I've narrowed it down. My questions were so ingenious. Now when I see that melon, I'm gonna be like, yo, hey there, dude. And smack him over the head with this block of hay. You ain't gonna find me, sonny. Wait. I should have known you were here. There's literally a pile of hay right next to it. Oh, jeez. Is this fake lava, huh? Huh? You should jump in. Test it out. I gotta make a pickaxe. I can't break that rock. And this boy right here, two logs. Melon, I'll be there in a second, okay? I'm gonna find you, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure you are. And I get this. And then I come over here, and it's like, put that there. Get some more planks. And Melon is for sure hiding in this fake lava. Yo, it's real. It's real. Ow. Yo. Did you get incinerated? No, I survived. I jumped in the water nearby. That was close, though. No. Come on. You're supposed to die. It would have been funny. Anything in this furnace? Wait, are these fake blocks or real blocks? Bro, everything is real. What the heck are you doing? Yo, what the heck am I seeing down here? Why are there fire particles coming out of the floor? Because it's not good. Why do the torches do that? And I, I hear you. I just got a better pickaxe from this blacksmith chest. You're down here somewhere. Yo, what the heck was that? Melon! What did you do? This isn't cobblestone. It breaks like glass. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Sonny. Is this one-way glass cobblestone? I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. Yo, you going somewhere? No! Round one goes to the real goat. Sonny takes the victory. Let's go. Melon, that was actually a pretty smart hiding spot, though. I gotta give you credit. You're so lucky, bruh. If only I didn't put my torches that way. Yeah, that was kind of dumb. I was seeing the smoke coming up through the floor. That was super sus. Thanks for the hay bale, bro. Now we can play. Wait, where did that thing go? It just... Uh, I think it did it again. It's on the outside of the diamonds. Why does it keep doing that? I don't know, Melon. It just does. Here, climb up and find the blindfold. There it is at the very tippity top. That makes no sense. You got two minutes to hide, Sonny, all right? You can still see me. Put it on. All right. I'm gonna hit you somewhere. I'm gonna whack you. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, what? Bro, did I get you? Did I get you? You did. Whatever, bro. I got two minutes to hide. I'm out of here. Okay, goats. For my hiding spot, I've got something really unfair. There's no way Melon's gonna find me. Check out this secret hiding spot. I just gotta go in creative, and there's something called scale blocks. Look at these beautiful items. I'm gonna grab a lime scale block of 16, and let me show you how this beautiful block works. Check it out. I 
punch out some of these leaves. I think I'll destroy this plank right there like this. And I switch it for a scale block. And look at that. Now, if I fly up, I gotta go above it, actually. Hold on. Let me just fix this tree first. So I put this back so there's nothing suspicious about it at all. And then I go from here and I drill down. Look at this. I'm so puny in here. It automatically scales you down one sixteenth of your size. And then I can build a house in here. Check it out. It's gonna be tree house inception. I am in a tree inside of a tree house build. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Just gotta make it a little bigger. Yes, this is perfect. And then I build the trunk up taller so that Melon won't find me in here. Oh, and I've got another idea to make this go eight layers deep. Yeah, that should be high enough. Then we cover it with leaves so it looks like an actual little tree. It's gonna be so perfect. It looks like a little broccoli top. And then check this out. Check this out. Please tell me there's a wooden one. Wait, there's ones made of saplings? What the heck is this? Oak sapling glass? Yo, what the heck? Bro, that is weird. There's gotta be oak log glass. There is. Perfect. Now, to make my trap eight layers deep, we need to block melon out from the top too. Like this. Oh my goodness. I'm playing four dimensional chess right now. This is amazing. Then, I need to go out like here and I need a secret door. Are there any secret doors? Uh, not really. So what I'm gonna do instead is get a chest. Check it out. Then I'm gonna store some of these oak log glass blocks in it so when I come back in here, I could go through this and hide out and cover it back up. This is gonna be perfect. And then I just gotta come up here and cover this up with more leaves. Yes. The plan is working perfectly. And then to really confuse Melon, check this out. I will take oak sapling glass and cover this like so. Because he's now gonna wonder why the heck I did this. And there's absolutely no reason other than to confuse him. And then we build it up taller. Sonny, you got 15 seconds left. Bruh, chill! That's actually lots of time. I'm almost in my hiding spot. Better hurry up, then. I'm hurrying, brother. I'm hurrying. Okay, that looks pretty sus. So now if I cover it, it's gonna still look sus, but not as sus. So he'll think I'm actually inside of these saplings, but I'm not. I'm underneath inside of the tree, in a tree, on a tree. This is just crazy. I don't even know what's going on anymore. And my build is perfect. It's ready. Just gotta clear my inventory, go back in survival mode, and melon. I'm in my hiding spot. All right, Sonny. Time to find you. Take the dragon head off, and I'm coming outside. Peep the village out. Anything sussy with this village, huh? Huh, Sonny? Guys, I messed up. I have to really quickly get oak wood and leaves. Let me place this block. I don't want to lose like this. Not like this. Break this tree. As long as Melon doesn't notice, this is fine. This haystack's looking sussy, Sonny. Bruh, why is it so big? There's gotta be something going on here. Oh, guys, that was way too close. Perfect. I'm ready now. Maybe it is just a normal haystack. Yeah, it's a normal hay bale. Trust me, trust me, trust me. What happens if I put an enchanted hay bale in a stack of hay bales? I don't know, brother. Why don't you try that and use your whole timer on it? It doesn't work. <laughs> Work, I've discovered. Oh, Shunny, where are you hiding? First question, Sonny, are you inside or are you outside? I would argue that I'm technically in the great outdoors. Okay, all right, that sounds good. Uh, in the great outdoors. Uh, where do I go with this? I guess, second question, Sonny, what block are you standing on? I am standing on a log. A log? So he could be on the roof of a village house or he could be in a tree is there any other logs around here i think those are like the only options so i guess for my third question sonny are you um are you on a village house somewhere no i'm not in a village house bro but i'm being goat mode right now dang it that means he's probably in a tree i gotta clear out these trees dude chill out what did the forest do to you i'm just gonna peep all these trees i don't even see you in any of these okay you can't be in these ones. This is weird, Sonny. I don't see you anywhere. That's what I want, bro. It's hiding 
excited, Seek. Why would I want you to see me in a tree? Uh, Kai, uh, I need some blocks. Give me some dirt. You don't need no dirt. Yo, guys, that's Melon right there. Look at him farming up dirt. What the heck is going on? You doing something shushy in this tree? I would never do something shush, Melon. I only play legit. Uh, they're not in that tree either. What the heck, bro? I've checked like every tree. Sonny, are you even in this village area? Yes, bro. I'm in the center of the village in a tree. You got me. You're in this... Wait, really? Yeah, I speak facts. But there's only one tree. Is there really only one tree? Uh, there's... There, no, no. I mean, I'm near the village. Just near the village in a tree. Not the center. Not in the middle. I'm literally looking at the only tree and there's nothing here. I'm digging it out. There's nothing here, bro. Wait, what the heck is this log? Yo, this is not normal for a tree to have a log like that. Guys, this isn't good. What the heck is that? Why is there a tree? And why did I see a Yo, I'm shrinking. What the heck did I just find, Sonny? What is this? Why is there a thick tree here? Why are you in my hideout? Get away, bro. Bro, this is the tree you were talking about, isn't it? No, I don't know what you're talking about, dude. I don't even have many blocks. Hopefully, I can build up. Guys, I gotta make my hiding spot even better. Let's get this chest picked up. Yo, what the heck is this? What are these saplings? What is this? How do I get in there? I messed up. I gotta make this thick. How do I get in there? I can hear you building. How do I? Wait, did I get in? Yes! I made it in! In what, bruh? Wait, I don't even see you. Where are you? You're nowhere. I'm no- No! 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 Yo, let's go! Hey, Sonny. No, 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 that's my trick. Hey, Sonny, let's go! Uh, how did you find my tree hideout? Well, you said you were in a tree in the center of town, so I checked there, and then I broke a weird-looking log, and then I found you. There was really only one tree in the... Vi oh, my gosh. There's actually only one tree here. How would you rate my hiding spot, though? It was pretty epic. Bro, that's actually insane. There's, like, a whole little world in this tree. It's a tree in a tree in a tree. Wait, I'm just tiny outside of it now. No, you're not even tiny, bro. I'm smacking you in the head. On my screen, I was tiny, okay? What happens if I drop a TNT in there, Sonny. Yo, try it. I want to see this. Will it create a black hole? I place it there, and then I go like this. Yo, it's still huge! No! You're dead! You blew me up into the void! Let's go! Well, Melon, it's your turn to hide again. I'm gonna grab the blindfold and start counting to two minutes. Wait, you still got that blindfold, bro. Yep, sorry. Uh, let me just... Don't worry, I'll get it from your dead body. Bro, what the heck? I'm out of here. You're not killing me again. And and I can't see anything. Melon, Melon, where'd you go, brother? I'm gonna find you if it's the last thing I do. Cheer. All right, guys. Next hiding spot. I've got something planned up my sleeve. If Sonny wants to use these weird blocks, I just gotta find them in creative somewhere. A uh, tiny box, small. What the heck? There's no mod packs. I'm just gonna scroll until I see it. Whoa, what the heck? Okay. Uh, I'm not seeing them. Where are they? Maybe, like, are they called scale? Scale? Yo, I found them. Scale. Let's go. Give me this. Scale box brown. Give me that. Give me that right there. Then I dig the dirt out. Bang. Yo, let's go. I made my own mini aquarium. Now let me shrink down into it. This should be a perfect hiding spot. Sonny will never find me. It's so camouflaged. Uh, Sonny, I'm ready whenever you are. Yo, that was actually pretty quick. Are you sure? Ah, don't. Melon, hold Hold on. Where are you, bro? Let me find you real quick. Where'd you go? No, 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 no. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. Uh, chill, chill, Sonny, chill. Uh, give me 30 more seconds. I couldn't see anyways. I still have this blindfold on. All right, I'll give you 30 extra seconds. Start editing now. Guys, do not try placing two of these in each other. It doesn't work. The blockception kills you. Let's just go back to a measly old little thing and enter. Come on, let me in. There we go. Never again. Again, not placing this down. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Finally, I can take this itchy dragon head off, bro. <sighs> now, where are you, Melon? For my first question, are you hiding in something organic or villager made? I would say it's more... Mm, oh, that's a good question. I guess it's villager made, technically. Yo, wait, what do you mean technically? What's up with all these technicalities? It's just technically it's what you think it is, but it's not what you think. Yes. So I guess I need to check the fine print on your terms
terms of service for this hide-and-seek melon. And you're saying you're in the village, but it's made by the villagers, but it kind of looks natural. So you are probably inside of a, a farm or a hay bale. Wait, you wouldn't. Nah, dude, nah, I would never be doing something like that. You're in a hay bale, bro, because of all the hay there memes. Here, melon. You're in one of these. One of these has to be a fake block. Chip, tail, sonny. Come on, be a fake hay bale. None of these are fake. Wait, why are these villagers hanging out over here? Yo, Melon, second question. Are you disguised as a villager right now? No. Are you sure? <laughs> Boom, bang! Ah, you weren't either of those. Pretty sure I'm not a villager. All right, fine, bruh. Where the heck are you hiding? Oh, guys, he just ran right over me. My camouflage is working. Wait, Melon, third question. Are you hiding in crops or hay bales? Uh... Mmm, crops. Yo, so not hay bales? You gave me more info than I even wanted. You could have just said yes or no. Let's go. You're not here. You said, am I hiding in crops or hay bales? How am I supposed to respond yes? <laughs> By using a big brain play. So you're inside of one of these farming patches. Break him out of here. Chill. You're not in this one? Means you've got to be in this farming patch. Melon, you're not in either of these. You only have 30 seconds left, sonny. Wait, the composter. The composter. Okay, that's a real one. Let me try and compost. That's also a real one. What the heck is this? Yeah. What the heck is this is right. That doesn't look like dirt. 15 seconds. And that looks an awful lot like a wobder melon. No, Sonny, chill, chill, chill. Can we talk about it? Can we talk about it? I won't be taken alive. Yo, what the heck, bro? No, I fell out. I was alive for a second. That was so weird. Melon, you got us both killed. But either way, I found you. Literally, just punched you in the noggin. I win. Fine, bro. But you want to check out that interception inspection? Yeah, show me what you did there. I don't even know how you killed me. Um. Oh, it broke. Yeah, it's gone. I deleted that whole world. Oh, do you feel good about yourself, Thanos? Yeah, I do. Melon, what is wrong with you? Good luck, Sonny. You can't just Thanos snap a wither into our game. Ow! I just did though, Sonny. I literally just did. Not cool, bro. Not cool. Eat my hay bales. I am dead. Not a big surprise. Thanos Melon, you've got to chill out. Put the blindfold on, which is now on the rooftop again. And then give me my two minute warning. You got two minutes as soon as the blindfold goes on, Sonny. Okay. I made it extra itchy in there for you. <laughs> bro, it's so gross and sweaty. What the heck? Yeah, I got it nice and nasty. You're gross, bro. What? I get clammy sometimes. And I put a bunch of grass in there to make it itchy. Okay, guys, I got two minutes to hide. And I have an even better plan this time around. Creative. Not spectator. Creative mode. And then I go back to the scale blocks. But this time, I am taking a beautiful blue box entrance. And check this out. I am going to fly to the edge of the village. And then I'm going to swim there's no way melon finds me this time then i'm gonna punch out a little hole in the wall like that and i put down my special block wait it doesn't want to go there um okay let me think about this for a second and uh I i've thought about it and now i'm gonna punch a hole up top like like this i can't see it's really dark okay everybody has night vision now so melon can't even complain about this one and then i put my special world in there did it work did, did it did it work this time all right let me swim in it worked let me in. Let me in my world. I need this. All right, I'll go up and in if you make me. And then I got to rebuild the stone. Dang it. And then it's like this. And then I got to go spectator. And I'm in my special world now. Let's freaking go. Now I build an underwater aquarium. I got to go like this. Grab a world that it wants. Set water. Let's go. It worked. This is epic. Then I need to grab Grab some coral. Yes, this place is gonna be beautiful. I'm gonna make a cool bunker too. Check this out. This is my hideout right here. It's like a little fish cave. This is gonna be so goaded. Yes, it's beautiful. It's freaking perfect, guys. Oh no, why am I outside of the box? What is going on? Oh, I'm good again. That was so weird. I can swim through the dirt, guys. That was dangerous. Everything's okay. No, I'm sinking through. I don't wanna sink through. What the heck? Okay, now I need some sand.
And... Yes, and some coral. We'll protect this coral at all costs. We need more sandy patches. I probably should have made the whole floor out of sand, but it's too late. Now I have some coral, and my reef is beautiful. I need some other colors, though. Like, we need some pink and some purple. Yes, it's a beautiful coral reef. Yo, I'm gonna spawn in some sea turtles. That's what this needs. Turtle eggs. We're gonna go like this. And it's a turtle egg sandbar. And then we put some turtles in here. Yo, they're actually tiny with me. Let's go. This is awesome. And some fish. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Puffers, tropical fish. Yo, we need one squid down here. Yo, let's make him a glow squid. Yo, this is perfect. My tropical oasis is completed. Now, I just need to give myself an effect. Sunny needs water breathing for all of eternity. Perfect. Oh, I need a turtle helmet too because it'll look cooler. Yeah, there we go. Wait, why did my turtle get so big? Yo, chill. Whatever, clearing my inventory. Oh wait, I need another turtle helmet now. That was cringe. Turtle helmet equipped. And now I go survival mode. Hey, pufferfish, I'm part of your team. I want to be in this oasis with you. Please, please be chill. Okay, I just stand here now and I kind of hide inside of my giant turtle and I don't think Melon's gonna be able to find me. This is pretty goaded. Okay, Melon, I'm ready. All right, Sonny, time to find you and destroy you. <laughs> We got just the weapon of mass destruction for it. Yeah, good luck with that, bro. You literally are never gonna find me. Bro, why the heck is the blacksmith burning down? What did you do to the blacksmith, Sonny? What have you done? Honestly, nothing. I didn't even go near it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm sure. I'm sure, Sonny. First question, Sonny. Let's hit you with one of the basics. Are you close to the center of the village or further to the outside of it? I'm on the outskirts of the village. Ooh, he's on the outskirts. So, on the outskirts near the water side, would you say? Yeah, <laughs> I'd say so. Bro, what is this flower? Why is it withering me? Get wrecked! Oh, it's a wither flower. A wither rose. I didn't even know this was in Minecraft. Yeah, it's because you spawned a wither in and Thanos snapped me. Oh, yes. I forgot. Hmm. Closer to the water side. Alright. Third and final question. What block are you touching right now? Sand? Are you really in the water? Under the sea, nothing is better. Nothing is wetter. Under the sea. Oh my. Dude, and finding you is gonna be impossible. Yeah, if you're a nerd and a noob, which you're both. Bro, and you're probably in one of the scale boxes. How am I gonna get to you? Uh, I'll give you a tip. Oh, it's gone. I was gonna say, look for a dying sea turtle, but he's gone. I, like, thought I heard a zombie dying before. <sighs> Guys, this isn't good. My sea turtles keep escaping and then going huge and then dying. They might reveal my location. Under the sea. Uh, Sonny, are you on the bottom of the ocean floor or like on the perimeter of the village stuff? Uh, uh, somewhere in between, close to the village, I think. I don't really know, bro. I did something funky. Oh my, Sonny. What have you done? I'll just say keep your eyes peeled for a sea turtle. I don't see any sea turtle. I ran angled them up, and I built a raft out of these here turtles. That's how I got back out of this island. I don't see a single sea turtle. Good. That means I'm gonna stay hidden. Oh, I'm drowning. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. Where are these sea turtles, brah? Brah, they are my secret weapon. I don't even see them anywhere. Good. That's fine. That means it's working. Oh my lord. What the heck? I'm checking near the village perimeter, and I don't see any sea turtles. Well, I guess they're big on my screen, but Maybe they're still small on your screen. I don't know, bro. I'm literally swimming inside of a sea turtle right now. What are you doing? I am being the goat. Sonny, is your place near the blacksmith village? You gotta help me out here, dude. This is not fair. Ow! The pufferfish just hurt me. Ow! Dude, we're on the same team. I can hear you. I heard you getting hurt. What the heck? You can hear this? I can't even see the outside world anymore. Bro, what? Where are you? I can hear you like in this area. I need some bread to feed my pufferfish. Be happy. Be happy, brothers. Be happy. Chill out. Yeah, wait, what? I hear stuff going on right under me. Why is there so much bread? Wait, you're seeing bread float? Bro, what the heck? Is some of this one-way glass? What the heck is going on? My spawn 
God is so powerful. Why is my turtle dying? No. Yo, you're below me. You're below me. You dug out some dirt. You scumbag. How was I ever supposed to find that? Hey, Melon, you have 10 seconds left. Bro, I don't even see your thing. How is that fair? What do you mean? It's, it's, it's very fair. Melon, five. Yo, yo, let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in! Let me in! What? <laughs> what? You having trouble getting in here, buddy? No way! I did it! I survived! Let's go! Melon, I'll give you a 30-second extension. 30 seconds? Okay, okay. I just gotta find wherever that stupid thing was. Please! 29, 28, 27, 26, 25. Melon's oogly. Yo, that's not a second. Yeah, but I, I'm just speeding it up. What the heck was that thing poking at my... Whoa! Chill! I'm being in invaded by sea monsters let me in yo i found the entrance let me in how did you get in melon your face is so hideous keep it out of my aquarium how did you get in sonny you only have 10 seconds left bro i can't get in there's no way in yes there is melon you must always enter from the top what does that even mean exactly what i said from the top of it you dummy all right that's it i'm gonna go mode i'm gonna go mode three Two, one, zero. I'm in here, Sonny. Where are you? Yeah, but you're fresh out of time. What the heck? Why did I get what? And you died. You fell out of the world. Let's go. My aquarium is so goaded. Ow, pufferfish, chill. I'm trying to leave you. I'm leaving you in peace. That aquarium will forever be remembered as the most goaded hiding spot of all time. Melon, how does it feel to get absolutely wrecked? Bro, you got lucky. Your thing is glitchy and I couldn't get in. It's not glitchy. It just outmaneuvered you. It was playing four-dimensional chess, and you were stuck playing tic-tac-toe. You know what, Sonny? Get in this box with me. Yeah, okay. Now what? Uh, just let, it, let the lag settle down. Yeah? Now what, bro? Hey, chill! Chill! What the heck? Yo, I survived. What the heck am I in right now? This is so trippy! Why are there three of me? What's going on? Quick, guys! Like and subscribe before Melon falls out of the inception world bro i just went deeper i went even deeper again i'm going layers deep yo can i keep going layers deep no i missed it i'm dead and click the next video on screen quick